Hello everyone, welcome to our next topic. In this topic, we'll see introduction of DSC, means Digital Signature Certificate. Under that, we will cover what is DSC, advantage of DSC, importance of DSC, type of DSC, and classes of DSC. So first, what is DSC? So DSC means Digital Signature Certificate. It's the full form of DSC, Digital Signature Certificate. is an electronic and legal recognized substitute for substitution of the weight signature. And digital signature is used where we can use the digital signature for online transaction or sign a digital documents. We use the digital signature there. For individual, why individual take a digital signature certificate? For sending an encrypt mails. And this digital signature is contain the highly secure file that contain personal information of the signer. And this certified certificate, digital signature certificate, is where I that the identify of the signer. I hope you understand what is digital signature. Now, next advantage of DSC. So, what is the advantage of DSC? Means digital signature certificate. First advantage is authentic authentication. Useful for ver verify the individual holder personal information detail when doing online transaction. Whenever you are doing online transaction, if you are individual and you need to be signed some document, that time digital signature certificate very useful for the whole individual holder, holder that, con that contain personal information of detail when they ever doing the online transaction, that, that time it is very useful. Next, reduce cost and time. You can sign PDF file digitally and submit them considerably faster than physical signature hard copy document. Comment and scanning them means for the if you have a digital signature, you can easily file sign the PDF file. You no need to be download that file. Then you have down. You no need to be hard, print out the hard copy of document mm -hmm. and then sign it and then scan and then send through the mail mail by the digital signature you not do the these things you immediately you can sign pdf file by using digital signature it is not necessary for dsc holder to present a person to conduct to approve or approve transaction third uh, second advantage data integrated government bodies frequently request means whenever we do the for government paper they are government bodies government documents that time government body frequently request for the certificate to cross check the validity of business transaction so digital signature document cannot be changed or update after they are signed making the data safe and secure okay fourth docu document authentic digital signature provide the authenticity for the document Whenever the recipient means whenever the recipient sign any document, it is ensured that by the digital signature that the sign is done by the person, son, who they are. Okay, so we do not worry about the document being be falsified in order or act based on them. Means advantage of DSC first. There's an authentication. So whenever individual signs some person document, any document of our online transaction, there is a authentic that the personal information detail is present in the digit DSC. So it is authentication that no one can misuse that. Reduce cost and time. If you if you have signed any PDF file, you have to download, uh, you have to first print out in a hard copy document then you have to sign then scanning it take a cost also and take a time a lot of time to do this if you have a digital signature you easily you can download your pdf file sign put your digital signature signature on that pdf and immediately you can send to through the email it take more hardly five minutes but when we doing manual signature we have to print out then scanning it take a lot of time so digital signature also help to reduce the time cost data integrity government bodies always ask some whenever we need to be do any uh, online transaction any government 
work they are like gst income tax they always ask digital signature for the signature so digital signature is very useful for the government bodies also because whenever we sign digital document sign digital document document for by the using of digital signature it will be present give the authentication that the business transaction the certificate cross checked by the government bodies and validated that the business transaction that is a valid transaction and document authentication digital signature provide assurance that the document is signed by the person is a person who they say they are so we don't we know not worry during the document that is that uh, document is signed by the right person or anything because digital signature provide a document authenticity also important of dsc a class 3 digital signature certificate means there are three digital certification is necessary for gst income tax e document e efo whenever we file tender submission government document we need to be use dsc sign that entire registration process for the digital for the purchase of digital certificate is conduct so this for the important of dsc that is the for the whenever we if necessary for gst income tax or epfo we can use the digital signature and this entire process for the purchase where we can purchase dsc sign how can we purchase process so the entire registration process of purchasing digital signature is conduct online is all all are online e mudra website from e mudra website you can verify user identify less than 5 minute after the verification the digital signature is made and download within 30 minutes type of dsc so there there are different types of dsc available for let the uh, signature dsc encryption dsc and combo dsc signature dsc what is signature dsc so signature dsc are useful tool for document signing for the purpose of submitting income tax return gst mc online form or other web based service we, it can be attached to pdf file or document it authenticate the user identify and verify the document integrity it granted the recipient that the document and the data mentioned have not been tampered with means signature dsc is a signed certificate which a useful document for the document signing what is the purpose of signature dsc its purpose for tax return gst filing mc online whatever web based service we use document means digital signature certificate we can use digital signature signature certificate by attaching pdf files or document it uh, digital signature uh, certificate it create authenticate the user and identify the and verify verifies the document integrity it granted that the recipient that the document and the data is mentioned is not tampered with means it is not wrong or anything false okay encryption dsc to encrypt file paper or other private or sensitive data for that we can use encryption certificate dsc encryption is a private date for the private data and document and this is the encryption this dsc we use facility for the upload online platform for business uh, document that upload online platform for business personal data for safety sent by encrypt it is it with this certificate so um document written e commerce law tender submission other private matter can all benefit from encrypt such dsc and combo dsc which sign signature dsc and encrypt dsc both are mixed that sign and encrypt dsc can use both encryption and signing signing document both we can use combo form combo dsc usually it is used to file application and form paper for the government okay and classes of dsc so there are the three type of dsc the kind the kind of dsc must be applied depend on the your need of the application applicant need okay and the reason why they need a digital signature certificate 
So there are three types of three kind of certificate for digital signature. First class one, class mm -hmm. two, and class three. So class one, this sent to mm -hmm. if this is for individual or private subscriber that use in a certificate authority database where where I for verify use this username and email address. Class two certificate is issued by the provide the signatory to author authorize authority in order from them the electronic file forms means government portal which we have electronic file for government portal like a website for uh, mca income tax gst or other agency that time we need a class 2 certificate that controls certified author authority has direct that class certificate now class 2 certificate is First, there's a three class two that use for, but now uh, from 1st January 2021, the class two certificates is discontinued. Instead of that, we use class three certificate. Now, whoever is, uh, now we are registered, we are do the register for class three certificate. So class three certificate, anywhere in India, we can use this certificate to part participate in and place by beats in online tender, e-auction, in order to take a part of online vendor, vendors. So class three certification, signature certificate need. Okay, for as I mentioned earlier, as of January 1st, 2021, class two certificate are no longer to available from CCA. So as a result, what happened? So as a result, individual who need to sign online form, register for ROC, customer, mm -hmm. customs, income tax, GST, EFO, they need to be obtain class three certificate. Means class one certificate for individuals and private subscriber, which are in this uh, certificate, in class one certificate, they have a authority database to verify username and email address. Class two certificate is it is applicable before January 1st, 2021. After January 21, 1st January 2021, this class 2 certificate is discontinued. But class 2 certificate uses is what the uses of class 2 certificate that uses for the gone file from a, on a government portal like a website of the MCA, income tax, GST filing, other agency we need to be class two certificate but after the discontinue class three certificates we can use class three certificate for this filing for government file form on government portal we can use class three certificate but instead of that class three certificate also help anywhere in india this certificate we can use for participate in a bids online tenders or e-auction in order to take part in the online tender that time we need a class 3 certificate or also class 3 certificate now needs after January 1st 2021 we need a class 3 certificate for also GST filings MCA ROC custom custom income tax return and other government agency agency filing we need a class 3 certificate and class 3 certificate also when we have a class three certificate, we can take a part online, you know, take a part in the online tenders of uh, and e auction. I hope you have understand what is DSC, advantage of DSC, importance of DSC, type of DSC, and classes of DSC. So, do you have any question or you want to reach us? You can simply email us info at the rate or contact in this number. Thank you so much for watching the video.